okay hi guys and welcome back thanks for watching this video today we will use solidworks for uh, drawing a part that is a picture or a drawing so stay tuned first of all we choose our target profile or image in this case is the fuselage fuselage of a horror hurricane and uh, the source of this information is this book scale scale l draft drawing and this um a list of of the drawings made from uh made by wylam which in this case by willis but okay sorry thank you guys and welcome back Today we will use SOLIDWORKS to draw a, a part which is a, an image, a drawing you will you like. So first of all we will uh, choose our target and in this case is uh, taken from scalar, scale aircraft drawing and for this video I chose uh, the Hawker Hurricane fuselage. In specifically the station 168 which is located here almost on the the end on the trading edge of the fuselage so okay so now we will make a screenshot the narrower the screenshot the, the better it is because oh sorry we don't have it's better for you because if you make a screenshot like this no good we will make okay i have already done it but i will just i will show you okay this one and we will call tutorial tutorial then we go on solidworks new part catch from plane tools sketch tools sketch picture we will go to tutorial okay so now we will move it and make the origin of the drawing to the lower part then we will draw one line, one horizontal line for construction yes and one vertical Now we will make a point there. We will measure. Okay, this is 290 millimeters. We want it at 200. Okay, so now we have drawing and we have to rescale it. So double click, start to. okay now we have our image scaled and fitted okay then we will start to make some points the higher the number of the points higher accuracy so it's up to you i will make only the minimum just to show you how to make it This is a very time consuming task, but if you make it with all the time you have, OK, 
Okay. You can have uh, Okay. You can when there are some changes on uh, the on the curves it is a nice technique to add more points. We'll see later why. Okay, so then we try to start to connect all the points with a straight line here we have sorry but every time every point is different from the other and requires same attention okay perfect spot This procedure can be can be done also on pictures from, uh, from everything you want. So technique is the same. The points should be moved for the the line, not after, because otherwise you will have some problem with the constraints and relations between the line and the point okay we are in good position okay, we can close it is not uh, no you will, will close later okay so now once you have this this arrangement you select no, you don't select anything. You go to spline tools, fit spline, close spline. I mean, left open because we have our open profile. Select the first part, right click, select chain. And go. Then the second. Tools, spline, fit, right click, select chain, open, and that's it. As you can see, we have um, an entity. So you, we set the transparency to one. Okay, so now we can close it and then we will build us vertical mirror entities one mirror entity two. Perfect. If you want to make it clear, you can erase all the points and all the, the lines because are still there. So once you, in order to make some clean drawing, we will erase the the the, the, the image, and then we we'll select from left to right all the parts 
If you select from right to left, you select all. Okay. Close it. Can erase this line, this line here. Okay. So now it's ready to be extruded. Twenty millimeters. Okay, that's it. This is your line. Thanks for watching and uh if you want to make some holes here, just follow the standard rule. I mean, sketch on surface, then we can, can This is one technique, I mean, it's not all. You can do what you want. And you have it if you want to make something or put something inside. Okay, this is to the last. Thanks for watching and uh, please subscribe, like it, comment it, request tick. If you have something, something in your mind, write an email and I will answer you. Thank you and bye. See you.